Hello, today we are going to learn how to convert a 64 bit data into a single 32 bit data. So, as you know, our PLC can process a maximum of 32 bit double word data. But there are some devices like Energy Meter which gives readings in a 64 bit data. Actually, there is a decimal point in that data, but it is not represented in that number. So we have to convert it or compress it so as to represent in a single 32 bit number. But while converting it to in 32 bit number, accuracy goes decreasing as the number goes higher value. So this starts. I have done programming for that already. I will just explain it how it works. As you know, 64 bit data contains two 32 bit number. First is lower double word and higher double word. So we will first take a lower double word and mask its higher third. 32 number bit. We are doing this because as a 32 number bit is 1, it indicates a negative sign that is a sign number. That's why we are masking it and later on we will add its equivalent number to that compressed number. So first we get a masked 32 bit number here. Again we will compress it by dividing it by 10 lakhs. So we will get uh, another compressed number which is 10 lakh times smaller than actual 32 bit number. In the next step, we will consider that mass bit here. If that bit is 1, we will add its equivalent number 2148 which is a higher number divided by 10 lakh so after dividing it we will get 2148 so we add that number into our compressed number so that we can get a total lower double word if one value if that bit is 0 we will add 0 in actual number we will get as it is. In the next step, we will do the same procedure for higher double word. We first mask uh, 32 number bit and get masked double word. Again, we will divide it by 10 lakh, but in that case, we will check whether a 32 number bit is 1 or 0. Why we are doing this? Because if the higher double word has a small number that is in hex 1, 2 or f and if we divide it by 10 line, it will give 0 output. That's why we are checking our 32 bit number. So if it is 1, we will divide it by 10 line, it will be 0 we will pass it as it is. Again, we check 32 number bit. If it is 1, we will add our equivalent 2148 value of that bit into a compressed double word number. And we will get a compressed equivalent number for higher double word. If it is 0, we will add 0 in that. Now, the next step is we will multiply that higher double word by 4295. Why we are doing this? Because this double word is at higher side of 64 bit number. So, our first digit of a higher double word is coming to picture after a lower 32 bit number get over means we have to 
multiply by our equivalent lower double word value means higher highest value to get a equivalent higher double word value that's why we are multiplying it by 4 to 95 it is equivalent of I will show you it is equivalent of 1000000000 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 8 times 0 divided by 10 like 429 means once our lower 32 bit value is over then it moves to higher 32 bit value that's why we are multiplying it now we will check it by simulate This is our lower third double word and this is higher double word. Suppose in lower double word we have a value and in higher double word we have two in x. Now it will give eight eight nine five. Now we will cross check it. Two, one, two, three. 0, 2, 3, decimal D is 889507 something if you divide it which by 10 lakh you will get 8895 which is correct now suppose we have here 8 then we will get 34665 now if we look at this 1, 2, 3, 0, 1, 2, 3, 4 now it is equal to that number hence by this method we can convert our 64 bit number into 32 bit number but the Accuracy will reduce as the number is getting higher and higher, but it is accurate with low value. Thanks for watching this, and please comment if you have any queries regarding this, and also please subscribe my channel. Thank you.